So we're going to talk today about Quickster, the new Netflix. Mm -hmm. As you know, Netflix made an announcement that they're going to split their DVD business and their streaming business. And the streaming video business is going to remain Netflix. And the DVD business is going to be called Quickster. So well, another interesting point is that the Quickster part is actually going to have games involved, too. There will be games as well, right? So, you can now get games uh, in the mail. But uh, they won't be integrated. Your, your, uh, your playlist, your queue in Netflix for streaming will be completely separate from your, your DVD list. Um, and I think it's, well, it's inevitable that they have to do this. Mm -hmm. I think it's the right move in terms of the, for the company. But Quickster on its own... I think it's just doomed, well, doomed it is, it to, uh, you know, to, for failure because basically what Netflix is doing is they are forcing their customers to make a choice earlier than they would have otherwise mm -hmm. to choose between DVDs and streaming. Now they say, of course, you can keep both. Uh, we're not, we're not going to stop you, but it's not really that convenient, right? So you, you're think, probably going to pick one or the other. Yeah, but I think I think you're also dealing with with a situation where you have early adopters who really love the streaming, and then you have parents or, or older folks who want to watch the DVDs, that sort of thing. So you basically mm -hmm. have two audiences. And they're, they're, able to, they're able to separate out the audiences. They're able to separate right. out the pricing as well. Um, and the games are kind of special because games haven't yet escaped the disc. So a console game, has you can't download a console mm -hmm. game just yet. Eventually that's going to happen, and then Netflix hopefully will get into that, or they won't. It depends on, depends on how the uh, console manufacturers handle it. But that's an interesting point to to say that GameFly and all these other all these other game companies are going to have to deal with that very shortly because Netflix is is the is the thousand pound gorilla. Right. That actually could extend the life of uh, Quickster and make mm -hmm. it uh, for a brief period. For for a period of time, I think though that Netflix decided that they wanted to move quick more quickly into the future, and the future being streaming. Uh, and this move, to me, more than anything, says that. Uh, you know that they will they will keep supporting the the DVD business as long as people want to want to subscribe to it, but uh, they can't wait for people to switch over. And so for me, that it's just a die. I mean, it's just a matter of when, mm -hmm. not if. Yeah, I would have to agree. I mean, this is a this is a complete die on their part. It's gonna Netflix has to exist. Netflix was the original name of Netflix suggested their goal, uh, and this Quickster stuff is just sort of a. It's sort of a diversion while they're uh, while they're shuttering their uh, DVD operations. Yeah. So die. But the, and the amazing thing is that they're doing this uh, before they have to. Mm -hmm. They're sort of shooting themselves or shooting well, part of themselves. Eventually, content providers are going to get into their game. So if they don't do it now. They're stuck. That's right. Okay. Well, there you have it. Right. Two dies.